Okay, so the question was, how do you change the units for your level datum so that they display in decimal rather than feet and inches when you're working with an architectural template? So the answer to that is uh, it has to do with the the units for the level datum head. Um, if you head over here to the type properties, you'll see that uh, the level datum head um, symbol is referenced here under graphics. It's this level head circle. That's the family that's being used, and that's actually what dictates the units being used. So uh, what you can do here, let's go find that here. So I'll search level head circle. Level head yeah, dash circle. Okay, there it is. And uh, I believe in type properties, we're not going to get any satisfaction there. So what we're going to do is we're going to edit this family. It's going to take us into the family editor. And then what you can do is you can change it here. If you're going to overwrite, suggestion, my, my suggestion would be is to go ahead and save it as, just in case you do have elevations where you do want the feet and inches. So I'm going to proceed on that basis. But again, if that's not, if you just want to overwrite, just go ahead and uh, uh, make the change here and then overwrite. But uh, And then when you load it back into the project. So I'll hit Save As Family. And let's call this level head Circle 2. Okay. And now that it's been saved, what I'll do is I will select the elevation label. And I'll edit that label. And uh, here... If you select it, the elevation label, you'll see a little icon, Edit Parameters Units Format. So I'll select that. And instead of using the project settings, I'll say, no, I want to use decimal feet instead. And maybe we want uh, two decimal places there. And we'll leave everything else the same. Uh, if you want a foot tick after it, you can certainly add that. I'll set it to none, but you can add the foot tick if that's uh, what you're after. And I'll click OK. Click OK here. And then load it into the project. And let me find the right project. And that was probably not the right project. OK. Changing the... OK. So let me go back to the, the family here. So, forgive me for that. Let's see here. There we go. That's the project. Okay, and then we go to an elevation view. And then with the level datum type, again, you may want to duplicate the type because if you're using level datum heads that reference feet and inches in one place, and you know, of course, you're probably going to do it for all of them because it's the same level datum in whatever view. They're not view specific objects, they're global. So I tell you what, let's just leave it as quarter inch head. And uh, not worry about that. And then change the symbol from level head circle to level head circle 2. Hit apply. Hit OK. And now we're at decimal feet instead of uh, feet and inches. Hopefully that answers your question. Let me know if you have any follow-up questions.